That represents the Ted Walsh stable, ridden by his jockey, amateur rider, son, Ruby. Then Gimme Five at sevens. Whale of a Night is on offer at eight to one. Lord Singapore, who's already won two, onto the hat trick, ten to one shot. Cork, it's a ten to one shot. New Co, the winner of the race last year, and he's one of three runners uh, in this race. Uh, Mouse Morris has that. Three runners in the race, incidentally, for J.P. McManus. Time for a run. That's one of his 12. Bobby Joe is 12, and it's 14 to 1. So go to the fence past the stands. Una's choice. Ultra Flutter, McNamara's band. Bobby Joe behind them on the inner. They're followed by Corkett, and then comes Hermes Harvest. All safely over that one and coming up to the next plain fence. It's Una's choice from Ultra Flutter, McNamara's band towards the left ahead of Corkett, Bobby Joe on the extreme right. Lord Singapore not far behind them, and then time for a run. Ultra Flutter leads there from Una's choice. All safely over and passing the halfway stage as they swing towards the back straight. With Ultra Flutter the leader from Bobby Joe on the inside of Una's choice. McNamara's band is fourth, and they're followed by Corkett, and behind Corkett is time for a run. They have eight fences to jump now in the Paddy Power Chase, and Ultra Flutter leads. Una's Choice in second, Bobby Joe McNamara's band. Hermes Harvest is fifth, Corquette six, time for a run seven. Lord Singapore is next, and then Shanna Gary. Solvang is next, and they're followed by Papillon, Whale of a Night, Trifurian, and Heist. And behind these, as they uh, clear the next fence, where McNamara's band made quite a bad mistake. Newco beginning to improve a few places, but they're well strung out as they race down the back, seven to jump, Ultra Flutter leads. Una's Choice is second, Bobby Joe is third. In fourth place comes Hermes Harvest, and they're followed by time for a run, and then comes Shanagari improving on the outside, then Lord Singapore, McNamara's band, Solvang, Corquette is next, and they're followed uh, over it by Papillon, Whale of a Night, Tell the Nipper is next, then Trifurian, New Co. Then Heist, and behind Heist is Gimme Five, and then comes Raihan, back bar, and Wild Hyde has dropped right out and tailed off altogether as Bishop's Hall. Six from home now, and it's Bobby Joe on the inside of Ultra Flutter and Una's Choice, and they're followed fourth place by time for a run. Then comes Shanagari, and behind Shanagari is Hermes Harvest, and they're followed by Solvang. Then Lord Singapore, McNamara's Ben Corquette, then Tell the Nipper as they jump the next five from home. Bobby Joe, Una's Choice, and Ultra Flutter. All uh, safely over the leaders as they race now towards the fourth last and Bobby Joe in the lead Una's choice in second ultra flutter is third fourth place is Shanna Gary and then time for a run and then comes Hermes Harvest Lord Singapore Solvang is next and McNamara's band Bobby Joe from Una's choice Shanna Gary closing on the outside as they run now towards the final ditch three from home in the Paddy Power Chase and the leader is Bobby Joe, joined by Shanna Gary. Then time for a run, then Una's choice. Behind these is Hermes Harvest, Lord Singapore, making steady progress, tell the nipper. And they're followed by Solvang. The final ditch, three from home. Bobby Joe is the leader from Shanagari in second, then in third place is time for a run, then Hermes Harvest and they're followed by Lord Singapore, tell the nipper creeping closer, they're followed by Una's Choice, New Co also making a bit of ground as they come down towards the second last now, Bobby Joe from Shanagari time for a run, then Hermes Harvest Lord Singapore and tell the nipper and the gap to New Co, followed by Una's Choice two from home in the Paddy Power, Bobby Joe in the lead, time for a run, Shanagari then Lord Singapore, tell the nipper is next, then Hermes Harvest a gap to New Co as they run the turn Bobby Joe is the leader from time for a run. Then comes Lord Singapore. Then Shanagari bang there in the centre as they level up for the final fence. Now, and it's Shanagari from on the far side. Bobby Joe, they're followed by Hermes Harvest, the English challenger. Time for a run on the near side with Lord Singapore and then tell the nipper as they come to the final fence. Time for a run from Shanagari and Hermes Harvest as they jump it and it's time for a run, the leader. Time for a run, the leader from Shanagari. They're followed in third place on the near side by Lord Singapore. Hermes Harvest and tell the nipper as they race into the closing stages it's time for a run the leader from Lord Singapore tell the nipper is next with Shanna Gary and racing up towards the finish time for a run the leader being pressed all the time by Lord Singapore Shanna Gary and tell the nipper as they race up towards the line time for a run tell the nipper time for a run just going to hold on time for a run wins it from Lord Singapore tell the nipper Shanna Gary four and Hermes Harvest five clear of heist and behind heist was Newco they're followed in by Bobby Joe then a long gap back to uh, Una's Choice, followed by Trifurian Papillon, then back bar, McNamara's band is next, then came Gimme Five, and behind Gimme Five is Raihan, they're the only finishers looking down the track. We see that Solvang was pulled up, also Corquette, also Walter Flutter, Whale of a Night, and uh, Bishop's Hall, and uh, Wild.